26, thousands of people descended on downtown Las Vegas for the Life is Beautiful Festival. But some say trying to get out of the festival was more like life is expensive. And 13 Action News reporter Tom George now is live with the story of one family who says their teenage daughter was price gouged just trying to get home safely. Tom. Yeah, well, Todd and Trish, if you've ever been out here downtown on holidays or weekends, you know, sometimes you do get an upcharge, but they say this was absolutely insane. Just to give you an idea, right now it's telling me if I wanted to go back to Henderson, it would cost about $23 for Uber or Lyft. But they say that weekend they paid about 10 times that. It was an experience Christina Vendetti and her friends won't forget. The weekend was really fun and so was Galantis. While they were out enjoying life is beautiful, their parents were waiting at home, thinking Lyft would be a safe option to get them back to Henderson. You know, for $50 and the kids can all come home, I'm very, very happy with that. Christina made it downtown just fine for $60. But on the way back, she was shocked. Lyft wanted to charge a whopping $216. They felt stuck. Terrible, yeah. especially when you're with all your friends and no one can do anything about it because none of us have anything to use to get home. Trapped with no way to get home, they say they had no choice. We had no other option, like no, like, we didn't really want to call our parents to have them like drive all the way down downtown because the traffic was horrendous. She made it back, but dad Nick wasn't happy when he heard what happened. Pretty pissed. Pretty outraged. Outraged, and he says ripped off. I think you were robbed without a mask and a gun. They say they were surprised because Lyft is a sponsor of the event. When they complained to Life is Beautiful, they were told, quote, Sorry to hear this. Although they are a sponsor, we unfortunately don't have control over how transportation services run. This is the safest way offered that we suggest attendees to use, but our festival is separate from their company. As for next year, Christina wants to go back to Life is Beautiful, but might think of another way to get there. People are leaving a festival. There's thousands of people leaving. Why are you going to, like, cost so much money? Are you kidding? That's highway robbery. I will never use them again. Now, I did reach out to Lyft Corporate to try and get an answer, but they did not get back to me today. Now, as for Nick, he says he's going to try and dispute the charge on his credit card, so that way, if nothing else, he can at least try and get an explanation for what happened. Reporting live downtown tonight, Tom George, 13 Action News.